Hey, it's Crazy Retro Games, and it has been done. Yep, that's right. The demo is made and published. Sweet. So, how's it going a week on from release? Well, you know, not too bad. As of recording this, there appears to be a total of 32 players having at least started the game. Although, seven of those are internal, so deduct those. But, um, yeah, I mean, it's okay for a little guy like me. Um, it looks like also I've had a couple of um, YouTubers play the game and um, just from watching those picked up a couple of issues. One with the colliders on the ship being too imprecise, um, which is a kind of a mistake. I, I don't quite know how it got like this. I think it was testing and just never did it properly. So, you know, this is going to cause problems going through those tight spots and the other um, thing that I identified by watching someone is that um, my personal preference for having the y-axis inverted is not necessarily shared by others so um, it looks like I'm going to be best just keeping that um, defaulting to false and people can change it if they like uh, so uh, these are a couple of fixes and um, a few others that are going to be going into an update for the demo uh, most likely over this weekend so it's good to have been able to pick up on those other than that well it's kind of hard to get feedback I mean, people are busy so don't necessarily have time to um, you know, report back on things they've seen um, so I mean one of the things that I fall back on um, is to take a look at the leaderboards because by looking at the leaderboards I can effectively see the progress made by players and by seeing the progress made by players I can see you know people who have played it attempted to play it um, and maybe failed to complete levels so th this is quite valuable to actually have the leaderboards in the demo by Looking across the uh, three leaderboards and having the knowledge of roughly what score means a completion and what score means a failure, not exact, but it, it gives me an idea just to see the proportion of people who have played and passed a level versus people who have played and failed a level. And, you know, or, you know, and maybe they've given up um, so that could be the game's too hard or it's not interesting um, it's it's tricky because this is looking at kind of after the fact of someone playing it so the wrong conclusions can be um, come to but um, I, I think a good um, benchmark really is the, the, the more people who are actually completing a level and getting a good score on the leaderboard is a good indication and um, having multiple levels in the game is useful too because um, and having a leaderboard for each of those levels is um, great because you can see who has had a crack at um, taking on a second level after completing the first level so it's just really useful um, really useful and this um, final leaderboard uh, which um, represents the bonus level uh, uh, mean what that means is that people have completed the demo and have had a crack at um, well this bonus level so I mean, not many you can see it's just a small handful uh, and I guess over time the people who play well this this will grow well, well let's see so we'll just have to see yeah, so that's the demo, and sure, it's just a demo, but it, it really does represent a substantial milestone in the overall game development process, at least for me. So yeah, this is a sweet moment. What's next? Well, the first thing I'm going to do after um, finishing this um, video is uh, apply the... Um, fixes that's been identified that need to happen to the demo and just make a new build and push that up to steam yeah and um, from that well 
I'm getting into developing the full content for the full version of the game. Um, the demo touches on a small amount of what's going to be in there, but there's a heck of a lot more that's coming, and uh, all has to be, you know, 3D modeled, coded, and tested. So there's a lot of work, and um, you'll be able to see some of that in um, my upcoming devlogs, which um, we'll see when they are. Well, that's it from me. Happy diving. This is Crazy Retro Games, signing off.